good morning to everyone. Kalimera se olu. We, we have another first this morning, and that is that uh, George is going to be doing his first Sunday translation. Might have to check his volume a little bit. He's, uh, he's shy of the mic. <laughs> and we won't pay attention to his strange accent. <laughs> Oh, it's good to be in the house of the Lord. And it's good to sense the Spirit of God. Today, the sermon is going to be a little bit different. I'll read one passage of Scripture, so go ahead and turn with me to Philippians chapter 3. Chapter 3. And we'll read verses 20 and 21. I didn't give this to you. No, I don't have it up today. Or you can just translate it. We're good. Okay, find it then. Philippians chapter 3. <laughs> While he's not turning there, it simply says this. But we are citizens of heaven where the Lord Jesus Christ lives. And we're eagerly waiting for him to return as our Savior. Now, obviously, the key for that today is the simple phrase at the beginning, but we are citizens of heaven. We, we have people in the room today who are, who are actual refugees. George is translating today because Lito is in Cyprus. She may be one of our oldest refugees, having to have fled her home in 1974. And over the years, we've had many come through. And they might understand something better than the rest of us. And that is what it feels like to be a refugee in a place that is strange to you. But we're celebrating our diversity this morning. Because in our series, we don't just go to church, we are the church. One of the things that's very important to us is that the church is not based on a diversity, it's based on a unity. Είναι σημαντικό ότι η εκκλησία μας έχει να κάνει με την ένωση όλων μας. So we have to understand that, that the Apostle Paul even preached this from the rocky hill in the center of Athens. Ο Απόστολος Παύλος το το έκανε το κηρύγμα αυτό από ένα ε, λόφο στη στο κέντρο της Αθήνας. In Acts 17 verse 26. Acts 17. What's Acts? The book of Acts. Ναι, στα ελληνικά. Πράξεις 17. And in uh, verse 26, he said, from one man, God made every nation of the human race. So we can look around the room today and we can see different colors and different shapes and everything else. But in our diversity, we recognize that we all come from one place. There's a unity about the human race that is not recognized in the world, but should be recognized in the church. You know the the phrase human human race or mankind in the book of Genesis. 
η, η ανθρωπότητα στο βιβλίο της Γένεσης. Right from chapter 1. Από το πρώτο εδάφιο. Says God made man, mankind. Ο Θεός έφτιαξε τον άνθρωπο, ανθρωπότητα. It's the word Adam. Είναι η, η λέξη Adam. Became the name of the first man. Έγινε ο, το όνομα του πρώτου ανθρώπου. But his, na his name was to represent all of us. So God wanted to recognize from the beginning that we are a unified entity. But then he immediately starts a diversity. It says God made mankind Mankind, yeah, yeah, yeah. All. Το ανθρώπινο γεύμα. He made all mankind. Έκανε όλη την ανθρωπότητα. Male and female, he made them. Ασιανικό και φιλικό, εκείνος τα πρώτα. So the first diversity starts there. Οπότε η πρώτη διαφορετικότητα ξεκινά εκεί. He then begins to tell mankind to move out and inhabit the earth. Και μετά λέει στην ανθρωπότητα, βγείτε έξω και πηγαίνετε σε όλη τη γη. And then other kinds of diversity begin. People who work with plants. Versus people who worked with animals. Eventually people who lived in farmlands versus people who lived in congregated centers. But all of that diversity was given for one fact, and that was that man would fill the earth. Of course, later we come into problems with that when we come to the Tower of Babel. And God sees people there who have tried to refuse the diversity they've gathered with one language living one way and so then God looks at that and says well we have to change the situation if they live like this they'll be able to do whatever they want but they won't do what I want them to do αν ζουν έτσι, θα μπορούν να κάνουν ό,τι θέλουν εκείνοι, αλλά όχι όπως θέλω εγώ. So now he scatters their language. Οπότε τώρα αρχίζει και τους, ε, τους αλλάζει τις ε, σκορπίζεις. And people had to move out and away from that place. Και ο κόσμος έπρεπε να φύγει από εκεί πέρα. A lot of people look at that scripture where, where God makes the declaration and they see it as a curse. Πολλοί κόσμοι το βλέπει αυτό και το βλέπει σαν κατάρα. But I don't look at that story as a curse. I look at it as God's blessing. Δεν το βλέπω εγώ σαν κατάρα, το βλέπω σαν την ευχή του Θεού. Because it caused people to go back into the flow of what God had commanded them first. Γιατί έκανε τον κόσμο να γυρίσει σε αυτά που ήθελε ο Θεός να τους κάνει από την αρχή. So now we come down through time and people are living in different parts of the earth. Οπότε ξαναγυρίσαμε πίσω στο χρόνο και όλος ο κόσμος ζει στις διάφορες μέρη του κόσμου. Probably developing different tones of skin and all the differences that we experience now. And God then looks out at the earth and says, okay, it's, it's spread out now, this is happening. Now he's going to kind of not reverse a process but take it to the next step. And so in Genesis chapter 10 and 11, God chooses one man, one family. And then out of that family, one man, Abram. To be a blessing to the world. And he makes this promise. All the peoples on earth will be blessed through you. Όλη η ανθρωπότητα στην γη θα, θα είναι ευλογημένη μέσα από σέναν. But now this wasn't going to take away the diversity that had grown. Αλλά αυτό δεν θα, δε, δε, δε θα έβγαζε την ε, διαφορετικότητα που είχε μεγαλώσει. But there was going to be something that now begins to bring people back together. Αλλά θα ήταν κάτι που θα αρχίσει να φέρει τον κόσμο πάλι μαζί. The, the blessing of reconciliation, of bringing things together. 
it, it, it tells us the potential that we have to fulfill the purpose of God. So now we come to the church age. And Paul stands on Mars Hill in Athens at the Acropolis. And he preaches to them. Out of one man, God made all mankind. And he affirms the diversity of people. Remember, he was part of, of a church that, that grew out of Judaism. And there were a lot of people in that church who were trying to make people become Jews before they could become Christians. Because they wanted everybody to be the same under the promise of Abraham. But Paul recognized that's not the plan of God. In, in the book of Galatians he will write that in Christ there aren't these divisions in reality. He says now there's no Jew or Greek, no slave or free, no male or female, not because those realities, those divisions don't exist, but because in our identification as Christians, those things become unimportant in, in the context of faith. So then we come to the day of Pentecost. And Peter preaches a sermon repeating something from the prophet Joel. He said, on the, on the day that this is going to happen, when this fullness of the Spirit of God coming happens, he says, God will pour out his Spirit on all people so that your sons and daughters will prophesy we're teaching him a new vocabulary <laughs> so your sons and daughters will prophesy your old men will dream dreams your young men will see visions And, and Peter says, this day is that day. And on that day, there's people gathered from many places. It's multicultural. They're in Jerusalem, but people have come from all over the place. And as far as we can tell, it seems there were at least 15 language groups that were there. There you go. And on that day, from all that diversity, because they come to faith in Jesus Christ, he brings them back together under God. Not because they didn't remain different in the natural, but because in Christ they became unified mankind again. The first man, Adam, ended up dividing. The second man, Jesus, ends up reuniting. And this is the experience of the church. So Paul tells the, the Christians in Corinth, he says the body is one unit. 
though it's made up of many parts, είναι ένα απλώς είναι από διαφορετικά κομμάτια. And all these parts have their own purpose. Και όλα αυτά τα κομμάτια έχουν τη δική τους σκοπιμότητα. It's one in Christ. Να είμαστε ένα με τον Χριστό. So Paul experiences the the beauty of the diversity. Οπότε ο Παύλος βλέπει καταλαβαίνει την πόσο όμορφο είναι η διαφορετικότητα. Corinth was a very multicultural, multiracial place. Η Κόρινθο είχε πολύ διαφορετικότητα, διάφορες φυλές ήταν εκεί πέρα. And, and even where Paul had kind of began his journey at Antioch in Syria. Εκεί που είχε ξεκινήσει ο Παύλος την, την, το ταξίδι του στην in, in, in Syria, στη Συρία. Where, where people had ended up from all over the empire. Που ο κόσμος είχε έρθει από παντού. And they're coming to faith in Jesus there. And the Bible says it's there that they are first called Christians. Και η γραφή λέει ότι εκεί είναι πρώτη φορά που τους αποκαλούμε χριστιανούς. Little Christ. Μικρή χριστιανή. Little images of Jesus. Μικρή παρόμοια του Χριστού. Think of the picture even of Pentecost. I wrote down just a few here. Την την εικόνα της Πεντακοστής. We had Barnabas, who was a wealthy Jew from Cyprus. We had a man called Simeon, who was also called Niger, who was probably a black believer, a African, a black African who had become a believer. Lucius of Cyrene. Probably a North African. Manayan, who'd been brought up with Herod. Who was a Hellenized Jew. Even Saul. Dude from the coast of what's now Turkey. Who had become a very devout Jewish believer. Ήταν φανατικός Εβραίος. People from all over. Κόσμος από παντού. Coming together in the unity of Christ. Όλοι μαζί στην ενότητα του Χριστού. So the Bible tells us that Christ tears down the walls of hostility. Οπότε η γραφή μας λέει ότι ο Χριστός σπάει την την εχθρότητα. Ευχαριστώ. One of the things I've always loved about being in church here. Ένα πράγμα που μου αρέσει πάρα πολύ να είμαστε εδώ πέρα. To varying degrees, sometimes there's a lot, sometimes a little. Σε διαφορετική κλίμακα. But we καμιά φορά λίγο, καμιά φορά πολύ. I don't know if we've ever had a year, Pastor Gail could correct me, but in the whole existence of this church. Δεν ξέρω αν είχαμε ένα χρόνο σε όσο υπάρχει αυτή η εκκλησία. I don't think we've ever had a year without people worshiping from nations that were in conflict. Δεν νομίζω ότι είχαμε ποτέ, να μην είχαμε ποτέ διαφορετικές εθνότητες που ήταν σε κρούση μεταξύ τους. Κούρδοι και Ιράκοι. Ιρανοί και Ιράκοι. Θα πρέπει να πω Σρι Λάνκες από όλες τις Σιγχαλίες και τις Τάμιλ. Οι Σρι Λάνκες από δύο διαφορετικές πόλεις. In fact, for a period of time, we were one of few churches in the world where it could be said that those two ethnic, those two groupings of people worship together in the same place. Είμαστε ένα από τις λίγες εκκλησίες όλο τον κόσμο που είχαμε τις δύο αυτές διαφορετικές εθνικότητες να να είναι μαζί στην εκκλησία. We can be Iranians and Americans in the same room. Μπορεί να είμαστε Ιρανοί και Αμερικανοί στην ίδια δομάς στο ίδιο δωμάτιο. We've had ethnic Turks and Cypriot Greeks in the same. Είχαμε Ελληνοκύπρους και Ελληνοτούρκους στο ίδιο, ο Κύπριο-Τούρκος τουλάχιστον. Για πάντα υπήρχε εκθετικότητα μέσα στο δωμάτιο. Και από ό,τι ξέρω ποτέ δεν μας έχει επηρεάσει. Γιατί? Because there's something that pulls us together that means more than our personal identity. Υπάρχει κάτι που μας ενώνει παραπάνω από τον ο καθένας πως είμαστε και ποιοι είμαστε. We are citizens of heaven. Είμαστε citizens. 
πολίτες του, του, του ουρανού. On a journey. Σε ένα δρόμο. The Bible says that this is not our home. Η γραφή λέει αυτό δεν είναι το σπίτι μας. But that in essence we are all refugees on a path to go somewhere else. Αλλά είμαστε όλοι πρόσφυγες να πάμε προς κάπου αλλού. Because our culture now, η κουλτούρα μας τώρα, though I still have a lot of, I mean, it's weird. I've only lived in the United States for 17 years of my life. Έχω ζήσει μόνο 17 χρόνια τη ζωή μου στις Ηνωμένες Πολιτείες. And I'm 52 now, so that's not a very big part. Και είναι 52, οπότε τα πιο πολλά χρόνια είναι εκτός. But there's still a lot of American in me. Υπάρχει πολύ Αμερικανία μέσα μου. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> We have to laugh at you. Come on. It's not a laughing matter. <laughs> We have guests in the room from America. Be nice. Now there, there's a lot of my culture in me. Έχει πολύ από την κουλτούρα μέσα μου. And God's not asking me to change that. Και ο Θεός δεν, δεν μου ζητάει να το αλλάξω αυτό. Except for the parts that don't reflect Him. Μόνο, μόνο εκτός από τα κομμάτια που δεν, δεν συμφωνούν με το Θεό. Because though we may be from Uh, from uh, who, from the Philippines, Philippines, or Africa, Africa, or North America, or any part of Asia, even South African. Though we're not called to give up that diversity. Δεν μας ζητάει ο Θεός να, να αφήσουμε αυτή την διαφορετικότητα. We are called to recognize that the things that unite us are more significant than those things. Απλώς ε, μας έχουμε το, το κάλεσμα να δούμε ότι όταν είμαστε ενωμένοι είναι πιο σημαντικό από αυτά τα πράγματα. And that when it when it, it's time to come together, όταν είναι ο, ο καιρός να έρθουμε μαζί, we put preferences aside, βάζουμε τις, ε, τις προτιμήσεις μας στην άκρη. And we find our commonalities. Και βρίσκουμε αυτά που είναι κοινά σε μας. Our commonalities in Christ. Αυτά που έχουμε όλοι μαζί στο Χριστό. We could look across this room and say, uh, this is what, this is Pauline language. I said, don't translate this yet. There are diversities of worship styles. Αυτό. There are differences of how. Υπάρχει υπάρχει διαφορές πως πως προσκυνάμε. If you came in early before church today, we had on a, a CD. Of worship music live from Africa. Not a lot of similarities to what happens here every Sunday. Yeah, a few close. We've had people from very reserved cultures. Έχουμε κόσμο από πολύ συντηρητικέ κουλτούρε. Who may not like it very much when Pastor Gail starts getting happy. We have diversities of theologies. We certainly have differences of skin color, size, language. We're going to find out in a little while that we like to eat different foods. And even though we may really enjoy some other foods, isn't it true that we usually go back to our own preferences? Unless something new becomes your preference and then you hang on. We can find a lot of things that make us different. Να δούμε πολλά πράγματα που μας κάνει διαφορετικοί. And I've, I've noticed something in 30 years of pastoral ministry. Έχω προσέξει κάτι σε 30 χρόνια του διδάσκου. It's, and this is not a bad thing, it's a good thing. Δεν είναι κακό πράγμα. It's easier to grow churches. Είναι πιο εύκολο να, να μεγαλώνουμε εκκλησίες. The, the English word is homogenous with, with one culture in place. Ομογενής. It's easier to grow a Filipino church than it is to grow Filipinos in this church. Είναι πιο εύκολο να έχουμε μια να να μεγαλώσουμε μια εκκλησία που είναι μόνο από τις Φιλιππίνες παρά 
από ότι είναι να έχουμε σε αυτή την εκκλησία που είμαστε πολύ διαφορετικοί. It's easier to grow African churches than to incorporate Africans into this church. Είναι πιο εύκολο να να μεγαλώσουμε μια Αφρικάνικη εκκλησία παρά να τη φέρουμε την εκκλησία μέσα σε αυτήν την εκκλησία εδώ. And we have to bring in things as diverse as Brits. Πρέπει να φέρουμε τις διαφορετικούς ανθρώπους όπως τους Βρετανούς. And Cypriots and Italians. Και Κυπρέους και Ιταλούς και Δανούς. Danes. Yeah. <laughs> I missed it. It's easier to grow churches in pockets of like people. Είναι πολύ πιο εύκολο να να μεγαλώνουμε εκκλησίες όταν είναι όλοι μαζί η ίδια εθνικότητα. And I, as I said, that's not a bad thing. Και δεν κακό πράγμα. We've grown more other churches than we've grown our own over the years. Έχουν μεγαλώσει άλλες εκκλησίες πιο πολύ από τη τη δικιά μας την εκκλησία. And that's fine. That's the kingdom of God. Αυτός είναι ο στόχος, είναι μια χαρά. But the vision of this house Αλλά το όραμα αυτού του, 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 του σπιτιού is that of the book of Revelation. Είναι από το από, um, Revelation, από την Αποκάλυψη. That before we get to heaven, ότι πριν φτάσουμε στον ουρανό, that στο could, παράδεισο, that we could come into one place on Sundays σε ένα μέρος στις Κυριακές and say every tribe και να πει η κάθε φυλή every tongue η κάθε γλώσσα every kind of people Κάθε διαφορετικός άνθρωπος worshiping here. Να προσευχείτε εδώ πέρα. I think it's a beautiful picture. Είναι φανταστικό αυτό. Doesn't make us better than anybody. Δεν μας κάνει καλύτερος από κάποιον άλλον. Does make us a little bit different. Μας κάνει διαφορετικούς. But it's a vision that we have. Είναι ένα όραμα που έχουμε εμείς. Because we believe it expresses the vision of Christ. Γιατί πιστεύουμε ότι δείχνει το το όραμα του Χριστού. That we could actually find ways to separate ourselves from our own cultures sometimes. Που μπορούμε να βρούμε τρόπους να να ξεχωρίσουμε τον εαυτό μας στις δικές μας τους κουλτούρες. And enjoy the culture of the Christian community. Και να απολαύσουμε την κουλτούρα της χριστιανικής ενότητας. Multicultural diversity and Pastor Gil, you can get ready to come. We're going to have lots of time to eat and enjoy fellowship. Σε διαφορετικές multicultural multicultural diversity. διαφορετικότητες, ναι. It's not something to be avoided by the church. Δεν είναι κάτι να αποφεύγουμε στην εκκλησία. I think instead we have a special obligation. Έχουμε μια πιο ξεχωριστή υποχρέωση. To be able to accept people in a way that's not natural in the world. Να μπορούμε να 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 δεχόμαστε τον κόσμο που είναι διαφορετικός στον κόσμο. The number one element of our culture. Νούμερο ένα πράγμα της κουλτούρας μας is supposed to be the love that transforms us. That because I have put on Christ, I cannot despise any other kind of person. Not the ones I prefer, not the ones I don't prefer. Προτιμώ και αυτούς που δεν προτιμώ. But that whoever comes to faith in him όμως έρθει σε πίστη σε εκείνον stands together with me κάθεται μαζί με μένα, ναι. Brother to brother. Αδελφός, αδελφό. I'd say sister to sister, but we're all sons of God. Θα έλεγα αδελφή στην αδελφή, αλλά είμαστε όλοι γη του Θεού. That there's nothing that pushes us away from each other. Υπάρχει τίποτα που μας πρόχνει ο ένας από τον άλλο. That even when we experience the things that could, because we can find them if we look. Don't look. Embrace. Because the kingdom of God is not divided by culture. The kingdom of God is not divided by culture. So we ha- we get to express the two truths that God reveals. We're all one and we're different. And it's okay that we're different because we're all one. That's the expression we want to share today. And there are a lot of people in this world 
Πολύ κόσμο σε αυτό το τσεπίδιο. Who need to feel that reality. Πρέπει να 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 αισθάνεται αυτή την πραγματικότητα. That we could be a place where we even let Brazilians come to church. Και μπορούμε να αφήσουμε ή και τους Βραζιλιάνους να έρθουν στην εκκλησία. One spirit. Ένα πνεύμα. One faith. Μια πίστη. One baptism. Ένας βαπτισμός. One body. Ένα σώμα. We are the body of Christ. Εμείς είμαστε το σώμα του Χριστού. And isn't that beautiful? Φανταστικό αυτό. So when you go upstairs today, taste some food that looks like you might not like it. Και όταν πάτε πάνω σήμερα, δοκιμάστε φαγητό που πιστεύετε θα σας αρέσει. I dare you. Σας προκαλώ. Try something that's new to you. Δοκιμάστε κάτι που είναι καινούριο για σας. Talk to somebody you don't know. Μιλήστε με κάποιον που δεν ξέρετε. That's from a place you haven't been. Που είναι από μέρος που δεν έχετε πάει. And enjoy the love of Jesus together. Είμαστε όλοι μαζί στη, στη, στην αγάπη του Θεού. Αυτό είναι το σώμα του Χριστού.